Hi everyone, welcome back to Kupani with Isa. I'm here to show you the finishing product. I want to apologize. First of all, all the videos are taking so long to upload. I woke up early, like really early. I hit the stores before 8 o'clock um, because Dollar Tree um, opened at 8 o'clock here in New Jersey. Um, and it's been pouring and stormy out here all day today. Um, and I wanted to start cooking early and all. So I don't know what's going on with the Wi-Fi, but the videos did upload finally. Like the first part of the cheese took like three and a half hours to upload. So I apologize for that. Um, the cake is was done in 17 minutes, so I'm going to go through it. So you guys have part one of the cheese, part two, and part three. Remember, I have an Apple iPhone. I do not have a pause button, um, so I have to break it down. Um, the video is bilingual because I had um, Spanish people in the page um, and family members that wanted me to do this, um, and that's why I'm doing um, the video in bilingual, okay? Um, also, the cake. It worked. You guys know that I said in the video, do to be safe, do two bags of the chocolate cookies. Um, make sure it has to be fine. Don't have chunks in there. Um, I showed you that. One teaspoon of baking powder and one glass. One glass of warm milk. Warm, not boil, not hot. Warm milk. One glass, one teaspoon of baking powder and two bags of chocolate cookies. Um, no, Oreos does not work because you can't have filling because it's not going to come out. Um, well, as that's what it says on Pinterest. So it worked. As you can see, what I want you guys to see is look how gooey this is. My kids wanted to get in and I'm like, wait, I have to video. Um, it's been done. I did this this morning. They're still eating. And of course I could not even give you guys the view of the ribs because it was just, they were eating and everything. So I couldn't even... You guys seen the first part, but I couldn't do the finishing product for that one. So there you go. It is so moist. It smells amazing. Um, the house smells like chocolate. I loved it. Um, so it was a success. You need no eggs, no flour, no yeast, no oil. Just three ingredients. Um, let's say that you probably have more um, bigger bags than I had. So go for, remember, and I just used a little one. Once I'm trying a recipe for the first time, oh, I always go for the smaller pan because you never know. Now, if you want to try it and you have a bigger family, of course, you're going to double or triple your ingredients, okay? So this is just, as you can see, this is what I'm going to say. This is a 4 by 9 to go on the safe side. I think this is a 4 by 9 or a 3. Yeah, this is a small I'm going to say this is a 4x9 um, little dish here, just a little square dish. Um, so it smells amazing. I put the toothpicks in. They came out clear, um, but it is so gooey. So it worked. The cheese worked. It's still, um, it's getting cold, but I'm going to put it right back in the refrigerator because it did suggest that you have it in the refrigerator for four to six hours before you eat it. Um, I don't like a lot of salt. I know it said for two teaspoons of salt, um, but I omit it and I put um, just one. Um, so I know it's going to be because remember, the, the cracker alone has salt because we're using the townhouse. Um, and also the guava is real um, sweet. Um, and if my husband wants it with salami and that alone is salty. So, you know, and if you're going to do coffee or tea or hot um chocolate or hot coffee you know so it was a success again i apologize i wake up early i like to do my recipes really early you know it's raining so i had all my windows open because i had the ribs in the oven i had the cake in the oven um and it's really cold so i'm coming back to you again in a few minutes to show you the new decorations of the new kitchen um i found everything so I'll be right back. God bless you all. Thank you. Be safe. Stay inside. I'm not promoting that you guys go out and buy all these items. I'm just giving you ideas. If you guys have cookies, if you have, if someone wants to try with vanilla cookies, let me know how it comes. But that's what um, the recipe called for. And we like chocolate. Again, if you're on here, it's couponing with Isa. Yes, it's a couponing channel, but due to the pandemic, I cannot go out and coupon for you guys. But I'm here to show you 
um, meals and different hacks and different things that we can do with the um, food items that we have at home. If I would have remembered this recipe years ago, I would not be buying cheese today. Cheese prices are in out of this world. All I needed was one gallon of milk, two, three, two, double the recipe of one third cups, two times of vinegar, and two tablespoons of salt. That's all I needed. And look at, I wish I had a scale because this is heavy. This is heavy. Look at, look at the color on my hand. And my palm is open. I'm going to flip you over so you know that I'm not lying. So it's like you make your own cheese. I don't need flour. I don't need oil. I don't need eggs. And I made a cake. So definitely I'm going to try because um, we're diabetic. So I don't do a lot of... Um, gooey stuff like that but i do love my chocolate from time to time so if i try it with other cookies and it comes out i'll definitely um record it for you guys so god bless you be safe please hit the like subscribe button notification bell let me know what you think about this thank you so much bye